This is a service announcement. Do not be with your baby mama or your girlfriend dropping them off to work in their car and trying to talk to people. That is rude, little boy. Don't do that. That is a no-no. You need your ass whooped. And that lady kid. That's the whole car. I'm back um this time i'm actually i just dropped my mom off to the doctor i'm actually just waiting in the parking lot but i'm moving my part because i need to find a different parking spot like i'm so fucking tired of being parked in the back but um i was gonna say oh um so, I heard some good news for y'all. It's a definitely go for my giveaway. So, this hold on stole my park. She's seen me coming for this park too. I don't like people that be stealing people parks. Like for real. Let me back into this other park before somebody try to steal it. Hold on y'all. Ooh, I'm about to hit somebody. Come on. Let's see if I got it. Oh, this kind of close. Okay, hold on. But yeah, so. Y'all, I had some drama last, the other day. Like, my best friend pregnant or whatever. And her, her baby daddy just went in together. And so what happened? So they have a so my best friend has another friend and between her and that girl they have a mutual friend. So the mutual friend that my best friend and her other friend has, the, the girl came to vent to my best friend about her friend. She said that her best she said that her friend had sex with her husband. So she came over to our best friend house to vent or whatever. Y'all, hold on, let me not get talking, but I'm having my breakfast. I don't know what's taking my camera so long to focus, but yeah, this is breakfast. So between meantime, between time, the girl came over to tell my best friend about the girl. And then littering and shit. So then, I don't know how it all ended up happening. The girl, my best friend, she like four months pregnant. Her and the girl end up fighting. I'm like, how does this go from her to you and her starting to fight? And her baby daddy instead of being let them fight. Because they being... She said the reason why she fought the girl because they was being too friendly or whatever. But that's neither here or there. You shouldn't be fighting. I said, girl, you should have called me. But um I just been chilling and trying to get some things situated or whatever. And you know, I've been like really I've been fasting and praying to God and trying to get everything situated and, and to figure out what is it that I want to do, what am I here for, you know? I mean, I mean, hey, we all, everybody wants to do this and wants to do that, but it's not meant for everybody. And I feel like you don't have time to sit around and wait you don't have time to sleep nine to five is your grinding hours those are the times you need to be grinding i don't care if it's passing out flyers promoting grind 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 you don't have time to just sit around and pout and cry and want to know what's the latest tea and and all this other stuff 
Stop worrying about them people live. They got their stuff together. Get you together. That's my biggest thing is I want to get me and my subscribers together. You know what I'm saying? So um, I'm coming up with like this little it's it's a it, it's like um a, I have a planner. Yeah, everybody have a planner, but my planner is is legit. Uh, I'm gonna be inserting some clips of my planner. It's gonna talk about like content for Instagram, content for Facebook, content for YouTube, content for blogging and vloggers. You know. Um, you know, like certain type of hashtags you're supposed to use because guess what? I just created my business account less than two weeks ago and I already got 300 uh, followers. You know what I'm saying? That means I'm doing good in three weeks. In two weeks, I got 300 followers. So, oh, excuse me. With that being said, I'm not, I'm, my, my, my um, planner is not going to be even $10. It's got my, my planner is seven dollars. That's not it's not bad. Um also with this giveaway that I am gonna be doing, I'm gonna be giving away five hundred dollar bills. So you can either win the five hundred dollars or you can win an iPad or you can win hundred and fifty dollars in Walmart gift cards. So it's you have three chances to win. So you know, I I give more details into that. I want with this being with, with this giveaway, I want to be able to get 1,500 subscribers by the end of I'll say by the end of October. I want 1,500 subscribers. But enough of that. You know, I, I just like tell myself, stop doubting yourself. Stop putting things off to tomorrow. No, do it now. While you have it on your brain and on your mind to do it, do it. Forget what people gonna say about you. Don't worry about the backlash and all of that. Because at the end of the day, they think it's so easy just to get on a just to, to get a camera and vlog and put your life and put yourself on this platform. It's not easy. You have to deal with the negative hate. You have to deal with the backlash. You have to, you know, know how to edit. You know how you know what I'm saying? It's just a lot to deal with because I have my YouTube channel since 2009. Ain't no way in the hell I should only have 500 and some subscribers. You feel me? That's because I was not putting in the time. Like, I have videos that got over millions and millions of views. But I just wasn't putting in the time. Like, when Shawnee's Cosmetic first came out, they sent me the 7 layer Master Palette. I got that. You know, I, I was in the groove of doing things and stuff. But, I just got tired. Just got tired of doing it. But, yeah. So, I don't know how long I'm going to be sitting out here. But, I know my mom comes from here. We're going to go to Rainbow. And, um, I, I, I don't have enough battery. I didn't charge my battery last night. And, yeah. You know? So, with that being said, y'all, I'll be back. Why do you give a fuck about what people think about you? Fuck them. Let them keep worrying about you. Do you live your life happily? Do what the fuck you want to do. Fuck them. Tell them to get on that shit and leave you the fuck alone. Do you, boo boo? Okay, guys. I'm still here waiting on mama to come out the doctor. And you know, I was just thinking. We worry about. We put so much. As us being black women. Sorry. We put so much negative energy and worrying about the wrong things you know what i'm saying i just think that we overthink things you know what i'm saying like men men be successful can be so successful because they don't think about it they just do it you know what i'm saying we got to worry about how do we look i don't want to work with her i don't like her you know what i'm saying i'm thinking about i, I i'm worried about product development you worry about how this gonna sell and how that gonna sell editing this and editing that I, I'm just worried about how much my shit is gonna sell but hey that's neither here or there you know everybody is different you know and I really really love the Glam University Miss Sabrina I love her that lady <laughs> 
that lady is that bitch, you know? Like, listening to her, her speak and certain things, it just clicks in my head, you know what I'm saying? Like, now nowadays, like, people be so quick to jump in a relationship because they, you know, think about this. Ask him when was the last time he read a book. When the last time this nigga went to, went to church, you know? When has he dropped to his knees and thank God for, for, for blessing him? You know, when is the last time you went to the doctor? When was the last time you dropped to your knees and thank God? You know, I'm just saying, no, I'm just saying, like, whatever you believe in, when was the last time you prayed to your God? You know? So, when was the last time you got your checkup? When was the last, what was the last book you guys read? You know? I read every day. I love Joel Austin's 31 uh, Promises. I read one of those every day. Um, Boss Women at Praise. I, I have that devotion, you know. I'm not saying I'm the closest to God, but I'm not as close to Him that I'm supposed to be, and I'm trying, you know. But, yeah, that's neither here nor there, you know. Everybody is different, you know. Everybody is spiritual, and and preface is totally different from mine. But yeah, I just want, I just wish that everybody could just come along and stop bashing each other. You know, YouTube used to be a platform where you used to get on here and people could be like, no, y'all need to see me when I say this. YouTube back in the day used to be a platform where you used to get on YouTube, learn how to line your lips. You can even learn how to make up a fucking bed. You know, it wasn't that much bashing and negative. Now it's all about negative, negativity, negativity, negativity. Nobody wants that. Why can't we just build together and come together and stop being so negative? Everything is negative, 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 negative. Not building each other up like, oh, you know, hey, I like, for example, but I really do like this YouTuber, you know. Hey, I like Leah because she speaks her mind and she's so real and beautiful. That's a strong, beautiful YouTuber woman, you know. I wouldn't mind working with her. Everybody, you know, but now y'all got the negative. Child, have you seen her vlog? This, this, and that. Uh, she just doing that to get cloudy. and do. I hate, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. You know what I'm saying? I just wish we could all just get along, but hey, that's too much like right, you know? Damn, it's hot in this goddamn car. I'm waiting on my damn mama. <laughs> it's hot as shit. And I don't want to go in the doctor because it's a lot of old people. Well, nothing wrong with old people, I'm just saying. Bye, yeah. <laughs> I'm fixing to go to Rainbows or whatever when my mama get up out of here or whatever time she get up out of here. So, the dude that cut my grass, he's real deal irritating. He aggy, he's aggy as fuck. Like, seriously. <sighs> dude, if you watching this, I'm sorry, but you just fucking pissed me off just, just five minutes to go. Like, you cut my grass yesterday and we told you we was going to pay you last night. You ain't come get your money. Don't call me. Don't be blowing up my phone now. I got things to do. I'm not gonna stop what I'm doing. You should have took. You should have came back and got your money when I told you to. But yeah, you know, that's neither here nor there. His ass should have came and got this money. This is a little ass monster, and it's a three door. Yeah, y'all. I ain't got that much battery, so I'm just gonna get up out of here until I see y'all when I get to. Hey y'all, look at this. Tell me how y'all think about my eyebrows and my little makeup child. I'm trying. I'm trying. Y'all, I'm trying. I'm going to show y'all my little outfit when I get a rainbow. Yeah, or whatever. So. But yes. Oh, wait. Before I, before I say bye. Um, like, okay. Y'all know I just been, like, drinking, like, this, um, like these or whatever for breakfast and I've been like I've been fasting like I drink that and drink water and maybe like um 
a fruit smoothie or I have a yogurt or something and I won't eat all day. Then like at dinner time I have like a little salad and so a couple pieces of chicken like sliced up um, baked chicken. And I have already lost three pounds in one day. I know y'all can say it's just water weight but fuck it. I don't care. I'm happy. I lost three pounds. I'm down three pounds. Yeah, 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 yeah. And look what happened to my screen y'all. This shit is really broke. But yeah, um, I got to take a selfie. Yeah. Yeah. All right, y'all. I'll be back. Okay. Oops. I finally made it to the rainbow, y'all. Let's go inside and see what they got. I'm always at Rainbow. They need to fucking make me their brand ambassador or something. <sighs> All right. So. <laughs> Let's go inside and see what they got. Hi, mom. So my mama is returning something. Hey. Okay. So I'm in here. I'm just gonna see what I want to get. And I'm gonna set my camera right up for my thing. They can't tell me I can't because I used to work here. So look at this shop. You gotta take it back to the mall? Yeah. Why? Okay, so I'm sure we have to go to the mall. Where she originally purchased from. Oh, this is cute. Oh, they are. Oh. They got some cute stuff in here. I'm right here. Oh, whatever. I kind of like this. This is cute in here. So you gotta go all the way back to the mall? Yeah, I told you that's gonna be coming. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So now we at the fucking mall. The other rainbow did not want to take take her stuff. So the other rainbow didn't want to take her stuff or whatever. They said she had to go back to the mall and she bought her. So, which was the mall. So now, I had to drive all the way over here to the mall to have her bring it. Then, the mall is so dead right now. Okay, you go to So, right now, this mall is dead. So, y'all walk with me through the mall. Crazy, y'all. The mall, so the rainbow we're going to actually used to be the rainbow I used to work in some years ago. And they plus out many people looking a little thin. They look, they look just like they lost weight. 
Let's go look at That's kind of cute, whatever. I never really liked it to buy anything in this one though because it ain't shit anything. Oh, that's, I like, I like this shirt. Yeah. Oh, this is cute. That. Now that is cute. I'm gonna get that for my sister in law for her baby shower. So, you know, I never really buy jeans from here because I can never really fit them or nothing. Like, they don't be fitting in shit. So. I don't know if it's out in the lingerie section or whatever. Let's see what they got. They have some cute little bodysuits. I think I need to get in. You get $5 for $10? Hold on, I think I'm ready. Let's see. Mm -hmm. I'll talk to y'all later. Look, this store, everything is fine. I know. They have some cute stuff, you guys. You know. So. They have some cute things in here. So, like, if you jaws and you know work out like little dresses and stuff everything in here is fine so let's see what they got let's see oh leggings five ninety nine Things for guys. 